Hello. Previously, we have mentioned ID3 and C4.5 decision tree algorithms. ID3 algorithm can handle only nominal features and nominal target values. On the other hand, C4.5 algorithm can handle both numerical and nominal features and uh, its label must be nominal too. Today we are going to mention CART algorithm. Uh, it's similar to C4.5. It can handle both numerical and nominal features. The main difference between C4.5 and CART is C4.5 algorithm uses gain ratio metric in its calculations and CART algorithm uses Gini index value in its calculations. Let's adapt CART algorithm in a real world example. Uh, this is the root directory of the Chefboost framework and I'm going to create a Python 3 notebook in the root directory and name it as dispatcher. Initially, I'm going to import the Chefboost framework, import Chefboost as Chef and I also need to import Pandas library. I can use the files under the dataset folder uh, such as golf.txt and golf2.txt for example golf2.txt would be my training set file data frame is equal to pandas.readcsv and here the location of my file golf2.txt Let's print the top 5 rows of the dataset. Now I can build the cart decision tree here. Chef boost framework dot fit and I'm going to pass data frame as input and also configuration file. And in my configuration file I'm going to mention the algorithm and it would be cart. Here I'm going to pass data frame dot copy to avoid the changing data set and let's store the uh, learning outcomes in model variable. The decision tree is stored under outputs folder rules and rules.py and this is my decision rules. It checks zero index feature which is outlook firstly and if it were sunny then it's going to check a uh, two index feature which is humidity i can make predictions based on this decision rule to do it i'm going to call chefboost predict and here i'm going to pass the module and test instance and test instance could be anything for example let's pass the first items feature values sunny as outlook 85 as temperature 85 as humidity and weak as wind the prediction will be no and actual value is no too alternatively you can pass a item in the training set i mean that instead of passing exact values here you can pass data frame dot ilog at zero index value or one index value or two index value for example two index values decision is yes and its prediction is yes too alternatively you can build a for loop here for index and instance in data frame dot iterate rows here we are going to call chefboost.predict model and instance this is my prediction and actual value is instances decision value let's print them both actual and prediction We can run the cart algorithm for golf.txt dataset. Let's clear the all output first and restart the kernel. 
and let's run all card algorithm is built and uh, it got 100% accuracy in golf.txt file too so we have mentioned card algorithm in this video and it uses Gini index value in its calculations it also can uh, handle both numerical and nominal features in the training set thank you all for watching and see you next time